New information at this hour about a man found dead inside a drainage ditch in Olmito. CBS 4's Tiffany Huertas joins us live with the very latest on that. Tiffany? Eddie, we're near the 26,000 block and Golkar Road. As you can see, this is the entire area where investigators were searching yesterday and Monday night after they received a call of the missing man. If you take a look, this is all very brushy area here around Golkar Road. Now, Cameron County Omar Lucio says the man was found wrapped in a shower curtain while Jesus Vela was found with self-inflicted now, today, Cameron County Sheriff Omar Lucio held a press conference where there he says that Vela admitted to beating a man in his 20s with a bat before burying him in a two-foot-deep grave. The investigation began Monday afternoon after Vela was reported missing. According to Vela's father, Lucio says he warned them to leave town because he was in danger. He allegedly admitted to committing a homicide and killing a cartel member. One of the officers on patrol located the vehicle and inside the vehicle there was a lot of blood splatter all over the place but there was no driver so we continued looking for that individual we couldn't locate him finally we talked to the parent the man said that the vehicle belonged to his son who happens to live in that area but uh, supposedly that he had some problems supposedly that he had perhaps committed a homicide on one of the Cartel members. Vela remains in the hospital tonight and he will be getting operated in the upcoming days. Now, as of right now, he is not under arrest, but he is under supervision. Again, this is just one of the many areas officials were searching for the body and for Vela yesterday. Now, we will, coming up at six, we'll hear more about what officials are doing in this investigation. Live in Brownsville, Tiffany Huerta, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com.